thank you so much for for being here. I've got a it's a wonderful program, and I'm so deeply grateful to the panelists for taking time out of their busy schedules to share their wisdom with us. This is a a, a uh, panel discussion in honor of the 100th anniversary of the Extension School, um, which was founded, as uh, Henry just said, in order to um, share Harvard's learning with the quote-unquote surrounding community. And of course, what we now find ourselves in is a situation uh, where the surrounding community of the Harvard Extension School is the same as the Harvard, the surrounding community of any place else with an internet connection, that is the entire world. And um, all of us who are teaching in Extension, and I am, um, have, uh, when we teach our distance courses, we have students from all over the world. And this has been a very successful program which has been developed with great wisdom by Henry over the years since it began. A, a decade or so ago, um, a number of major research universities started major distance education programs based on internet technology uh, at a cost of tens of millions of dollars, and some of those um, failed, quite frankly. Um, this one has been enormously successful uh, because of the incremental way that it has developed. But here we are at a moment, um, some kind of cusp in time, given the, the uh, diffusion of broadband technology to everywhere and our increasing reliance on it and the arrival into adulthood of the first uh, generation uh, of young people that was born digital. And so it is an appropriate moment for us to have a reflection on, in the large, on what the impact of the internet is on higher education in particular. Um, the kind of education that we do here in Harvard College, in the Extension School, um, and that uh, reaches out through uh, our uh, worldwide neighborhood in that way. So that's the that's the thesis of the um, of the uh, of the of the discussion that we're now going to have. Um, what's the impact of the ubiquitous availability of uh, information? everywhere in the world at, uh, at, a, at a, a click of the mouse and all of the social forces that have grown up around the internet. Um, uh, how do they affect how we should think about higher education in the future? 